dude I, there's so many I, possibilities so many my i just i could sit here and just think for like a whole i just about well, all the endless possibilities that could happen i just i get my hopes up too much about what i want like i saw someone uh like a wrestling account tweet out today i think it was like wrestle features or something that was like who are your top uh favorites or like your predictions to win the rumble matches and first of all, I am sickened by the amount of people who actually want CM Punk to win the Rumble. Oh, that, guys, wait, I, like, it's, don't tell me it's like a majority amount. Yeah, yeah, a lot Are of them were serious? saying, yeah, a lot of them were saying CM Punk or there was, uh, I saw a lot of CM Punk or Sammy or CM Punk or Gunther. Okay. That was a lot of what I was seeing. Um, but I can take either Sammy or Gunther. Dude, but that's... I responded and I was like, I will never understand the people choosing punk. That was my response. Like, I didn't even answer the question. I was just like, you guys are dumb. Like, you're dumb. No, that's like, okay, fan perspective of punk. Yes, that's awesome. Great for his story if you are an only CM Punk fan. All right, now let's take like a couple steps back, Sarah, and realize how dumb that is and how that would pigeonhole him for Mania that he couldn't face Austin. He couldn't have just a banger non-sanctioned type match with Seth Rollins. Well, like, but also, he, guys, he's, he's going to Raw. You want him to face Roman? If he goes to Raw, he can't face Roman, technically. Yeah, he's going to Raw, 100%. And that's the thing is, like, uh, it, what, we're, why are we all of a sudden now abandoning the idea of Cody versus Roman? Instead, you want Punk versus Roman. Why? Like, there's just no, like, no. and fickle. It's just they are fickle that's pickles. The that's the that's the you word for every everything there. right now. Patriots fans. Everyone's just See, fickle. Richard, it's just Richard says Sammy for Rumble. I want Gunther, dude. Yeah, I want Gunther, but if I need Sammy Gunther. Won, I wouldn't be disappointed. <sighs> I, I would you and your your Imperium boys. Well, but th but this is the thing. This is okay. So other than my bias of what uh, because I love Imperium and whatever. Yeah. My thing is when it comes to wanting Gunther um, to win the Rumble is he is somebody that we have talked about feeling like he's stagnant, like that he's bigger than the Intercontinental Championship. Okay, so that means that he shouldn't win the Rumble. Someone else should, and then they should be feuding with the champion, and then Gunther either loses the title and then has nothing to do or he continues having the title and still feeling too big for the title meaning he's still stagnant and doing nothing i don't understand how that makes any sense like do we want sammy to win maybe at some point yeah like i get it but like at the same time he's already had multiple title like world title chances he's already had main events for the title like gunther mm -hmm. is not there yet so like wouldn't it make sense and because then the other thing is people are like, no, I want Gunther to face Brock Lesnar at Mania. Why, though? Like, why? Like, you're saying he should face Brock Lesnar because you want to see it more than him trying to advance his career and be in a title match at Mania? No, Sarah, if Gunther versus Brock was for the title and Gunther's the champion, like a year down the line, are you for that match? Mania 41, sure. SummerSlam next year, sure. Yeah, Mania okay. 40. All right, I'm just I'm just gauging where you're at. Okay. I'm fine with Gunther versus Lesnar. I was here for that when it was being teased, like when it was like an idea. Mm -hmm. I just don't think that it needs to happen at Mania because I feel like when Gunther loses the title, he need like I've said this a million times, he needs to have a path to follow to get him to the main event. Otherwise, he just had this historic title reign for nothing. And it's like, you you can't just take the title off of him and then be like, okay, let's see what's next. No. Like, yeah. you don't keep a title on a guy for this long. You don't make this intercontinental title almost rival the heavyweight championship on Raw or even feel more important than the universal title because Roman's never around. You then take it off of him and then have him fend for himself, basically. That doesn't make any sense. Like, you don't do that with a guy like Gunther. You need to have, a, like, a plan in place. You need to have something figured out for him. But Absolutely, yeah. 